Hi friends, you are watching Tony Tech. Friends, if you want more info or uh, information, please visit my channel and click on this subscribe button. Okay. Uh, so let's get into our today's episode or video. That is how to download and install Sport Player. Uh, for like 32 bit and 64 bit. Okay. Uh, sorry for the mistake. So first step is open your browser and go to Google. Okay, I'm taking Google. Hit on enter. Uh, one minute. I don't know why net is somewhat slow. Yeah, Google came. And please uh, type download for player. Yeah, I got it over here and hit on enter. And the main website is, and one minute I'll show you. Yeah, the main site is this site, okay? Dompodplayer.com slash download. Yeah, please visit that site, that will be the virus and virus safer and uh, the means most safest place, okay? And I'm taking that site. Okay, friend. Uh, you if your Windows is 32 bit, uh, you can download it uh, this option. And if your Windows is 64 bit, you can download this option also. Okay. Uh, I am download my Windows is 64 bit. That's why I am downloading the 64 bit version. That is 1.6.63891. Same, same. Oh yeah. Uh, but bit is different. Yeah. So that I am clicking on this. Yeah. It will ask you the location where you want to download it. I'm clicking on desktop here. Yeah. Okay, click on save. We'll start the download. Friends, I'm canceling this. Uh, means I'm canceling this downloading because you can see over here I already downloaded it. Uh, now, before going to installation, I will show you and uh, means I will show you the system requirements and. Uh, <coughs> one minute, sorry. Uh, I'll show you the procedures all. Uh, one minute. Uh, okay. Here, uh, the 32 bit version is 19.7 MB and 64 bit uh, version is 20.6 MB. Yeah. Okay. So I'll go back once and go, uh, go back to Google. I'll show you the system requirement. Okay. Uh, remove this download. And <coughs> you can type. For player system requirements, you can take it over here. Yeah. So that, yeah. And please take this first one, this one, okay. This is the main one, okay. Uh, I will keep all these links in the description, okay. I am clicking on it. It will take you the, uh, to the reviewsoft.com. So that, yeah, you will get the general info, category, system requirements, download info, all. But uh, they in, in download info they gave the older versions size uh, okay popularity ratings price everything you will get over, over here uh, this is the version means version list it was added the first version on 10 June 2015 but this is 2017 okay 2017 Woo! sorry oh yeah I'll read everything for you category operator operating system windows program category audio and multimedia program subcategory media players yeah system requirements yeah program install support install and uninstall system requirements no special requirements oh yes support is uh, windows 7 64 bit windows xp windows vista windows 7 32 bit windows 8 32 bit windows 8 64 bit and windows 10 uh, 32 bit windows 10 64 bit windows 8 um, <coughs> normal Windows 8 and Windows 10 normal okay and the old um, version is you can see the uh, download uh, means uh, the ratings okay total is 30, 383 rating uh, okay uh, version history is this one this is the new one brand new one okay but uh, this is the older version they added new one again in this first January 2017 Whoa. So friends, we will get into our installation process. Okay, I'm minimizing my browser. 
yeah you can see here my <coughs> my uh, setup is over here i am clicking on it okay i am taking it will ask you for the administrative uh, permission uh, click on yes then next procedure also it will come yeah and packing data you can see here yeah so we'll wait for it <coughs> oh yeah unpacking finish yeah please click on this english uh, language you can choose another languages also uh, okay i'm choosing english please click on okay oh see so that awesome right yeah click on uh, next to continue and um, uh, pl uh, player and user license agreement eula you can see right you can say eula man eula uh, click on a i agree you can see here associate all files supported by port player you can see uh, please don't click on these two options means uh, that if you click on that you won't be able to open mkv like that uh, formats okay uh, if you click on associate all files supported by port player okay but some files are not supported then also no problem that's not a big big problem so base required is 65.9 mb that is very 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 less than gom player yeah please click on next uh will ask you for the destination folder or location where you want to install it i am uh, you know, taking my favorite folder <coughs> means where i am installing all the softwares so yeah uh, uh, please click on install over here we'll start the install extracting executing everything i can see over here output folder everything you can see here uh, means you can see here uh, please wait while port player 64 bit see that see that uh, they gave different uh, version number in online so uh, understood right uh, this is the older one but here you can see the new version yeah it's in the last procedure Woo. sorry i was little excited You can see install additional codec run port player version 1.6. Okay, please install this or check this option. Okay, click on close. You can see it, it, it is downloading the additional codecs. It is 10 MB, 10.73 MB. Okay, it will download one minute remaining don't know nowadays my net is becoming somewhat slow i'm very 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 sorry for that you can see here right <coughs> uh, by that time i'll show you something more general info you publish a core player a uh, publisher home page you see the, here this is the main site okay date added release date pro program release status major update yeah if day by day they are updating the software that's the some small problem day by day it will show you while playing a video it will show you for the uh, update you can choose whether to download or close them please don't keep in the settings so please don't keep the option for automatic update because it will increase like that because i said you right day by day they are updating the software that's why uh, a big problem it will cause more than 300 mb it will cause you know like a small video size short film size if you want means you can i just said oh it is unpacking the codex yeah came here right click on i agree next okay the personal port player yeah start completed close okay oh shit man what the fuck is oh yeah it came here yeah. then click on close 
setup was in the completed successfully okay close now i'll show you some videos uh, one minute thing so i'm having some videos don't know friends Mm. Oh my god. Yeah, one minute. Oh no, dead man. I'll play some of these songs, I think so. One minute. Uh, click on open with. Choose default program. I'm choosing port player. You can see the 64 bit. Oh, see here. WAV, everything is supportable, I think so. Yeah, I will open now. Hi friends, you are watching Tony Tech. Uh, so that okay, and please see this. You can uh, also take this TV over, open chat room or list of broadcasts or playlist. I'll show you that also. See, whoa, so cold man. Cool. See that you will get the day wiki and daily motion also. But you should have an internet connection, okay? So oh, that is all about and settings over here and video subtitle playback everything you will get over here, okay? And play button, stop button uh, means seek back, uh, seek forward, play next and open file, okay? And all those this is the transparency, okay? See I can uh, decrease the transparency. I decrease uh, increased full okay so friends that's it if you like my video please don't forget to subscribe uh, if you like my video give a thumbs up and don't forget to share my video bye friends